Hey, it's Scott Young here. If you're looking for how to get free traffic for your affiliate marketing, stick around because I'm going to share with you seven of the best free traffic sources for affiliate marketing. But before I do, I want to let you know about my number one recommendation for making money online right now. I'm going to drop a link below this video in the description and you can check it out. No pressure. Okay. There is a ton of traffic out there for the taking. And even though I'm going to share with you seven really good sources today, I want you to know that you need to narrow it down to one or two, maybe three traffic sources. It's important to be picky because even though you're not going to be spending money on these traffic sources, they're totally free. You are going to need to spend some time on the traffic sources. And because time is limited, you know, you're going to want to narrow it down to one to three traffic sources that you can reasonably spend the time to start cultivating. And also keep in mind that free does not mean easy. All right, let's run through the seven free traffic sources, you know, take some notes and, you know, narrow it down to two or three that you can really focus on. And again, if you try to take advantage of all of them, you're going to spread yourself too thin and there's going to be too much to learn and to cultivate in all these traffic resources. So, so listen to all seven and then narrow it down and then really focus on a couple of those. Now, real quick, some of these are going to scale really well, right? Like YouTube and TikTok you can actually just put in the same amount of work and really scale it up to huge traffic numbers. But these ones are going to take a little more time to get going. Some of the other ones that I'm going to mention below, you can get started right away and start driving traffic, but you can't scale them too well because it's going to take too much time to you know, really reach, you know, tens of thousands and millions of people. But you know, you pick the ones that you think are going to work best for you and you're going to drive some good traffic to your site. Free traffic source number one is SEO, which is search engine optimization. So with SEO, you want to create an affiliate marketing website and you could use something like Squarespace or Wix. They make it super easy to do. And then you're going to start doing SEO to optimize your website and the blog post. And you're going to start generating organic free traffic through Google. SEO is one of the greatest free traffic sources out there partially because Google is the number one search engine. And so if you can get on that first page and if you can get in those top three to five uh, search results, I mean, you are going to send a flood of traffic no matter what to your website. But you might be thinking, how am I going to compete with all the existing websites that are already ranking on Google? Well, here's a little strategy for SEO I want you to check out. It's called low competition keywords. So if you go to Google Keyword Planner and you type in a keyword related to your niche, it's going to give you hundreds of results, right? Well, there's a little column that's called competition and you could sort that column from low to high. And here's the key. You want to target the low competition keywords, the ones that nobody is really writing content or articles about, right? And so if you focus on those low competition keywords, you're almost guaranteed to show up in the first page of the Google search results because nobody else is trying to make content about that. So that's kind of a secret hack to get a new website, you know, a new URL to start ranking high in the Google search results is that you go for those low competition keywords and you just start making article after article after article about those. And then pretty soon you get a flood of traffic coming to your website. Traffic source number two is blog commenting. Blog commenting is a great free traffic source for affiliate marketing because all you have to do is comment on other blogs in your niche. And when you comment on blogs in your niche and you provide some value in your comments, you know, you could drop a link here or there and it's going to drive a lot of traffic to your website, especially if you're providing value in those comments on the blogs. Now, you don't want to use bots or software or any other sort of spammy stuff to just like put a ton of comments out there, because like I said, you know, your comments are going to be blocked or removed if you're not actually providing comments in there, because the, the blog owner in your niche that you're trying to comment on, you know, they don't want a bunch of spam on their <laughs> comment section. So make sure you're putting some value in there. You're teaching one or two little things. It doesn't have to be long. And then you will be able to keep your comment on there with your link and your URL. Traffic source number three is Quora. You know, do you know a lot about your niche? Well, that's good. You know, you're probably an expert compared to everybody else who doesn't really know anything about your niche. So you can go on Quora and set up a profile and start answering questions like crazy on there. You could sprinkle in your affiliate link here or there throughout the answers that you're giving. 
And you can also add a link in your bio on Quora. So when people are reading your answers, you know, they're going to be curious who you are and they're going to click on your bio and they're going to see the link to your website or your affiliate offer. So reply to about a dozen questions every single week on Quora. And before long, you'll start to see a flood of traffic heading to your website because when you answer questions on Quora, Quora ranks very high in the Google search results. So it's an easy way to get in the top search results just by answering questions every week. Free traffic source number four is Pinterest. Pinterest is a huge social network that you can use as a free traffic source for affiliate marketing websites and products. Now, they get over 1 billion unique visits every single month, and it's ranked number 27 in the worldwide traffic. So it's something you definitely don't want to ignore. Now, many websites are using Pinterest to get a ton of traffic, and there's a ton of them that are doing affiliate marketing. Now, Pinterest is a very visually oriented search engine. So when you post your blog and articles on Pinterest, you want to make sure that you've created a really nice visual pin so that people will be attracted to click on that pin so they go to your website. Now, you may be thinking, man, I'm not really that great at creating graphics and things like that for something like Pinterest. But here's the thing. If you go to a website called canva.com, they actually have over 5,000 Pinterest pin templates. And all you have to do for each of your articles is just go to the template and edit the text so that it relates to the keyword in your article and all the graphics and everything are already in those templates. So think about it. You've got 5,000 templates ready to go. So Pinterest could be a really simple way to drive traffic to your site. Traffic source number five is YouTube. Now, these days, there are a ton of digital tools that make it super easy to make videos. The beauty with YouTube is that you are making a real connection with your viewer and your audience through the video itself because it's you talking to them. And you can easily promote your affiliate website or products in the link below the video in the description. Or once you get enough followers and views on YouTube, you can actually put links to your website and your affiliate page kind of overlaid right in your video. So as people are watching the video, they can click the link and go straight to your website. Now, YouTube is the number two search engine on all of the internet. So like Google, you can use that same SEO strategy that I told you about just a minute ago, where you could find low, com low competition keywords for YouTube, and you could make short two to three minutes about that low competition keyword on YouTube. And you're almost guaranteed to show up in the first three to five results on YouTube if you're making videos about those low competition keywords. Free traffic source number six is Facebook. You know, on Facebook, you can create your own Facebook group anytime you want. And you could create a Facebook group that you'd like to promote your affiliate products in for a certain niche. And then you could post your articles in there and you could post your links and everything you want to in there. Now, the thing is, when you create your own Facebook group, you control that group. You're the moderator. So, you know, if you've got a really great article that really points to what you're doing and your affiliate product, you, know, you could pin that at the top. So if you've got hundreds or thousands of people joining your group, they're all going to see that, see that pinned article right at the top of the Facebook group. So you can start inviting people from other similar niche groups out there or family and friends if you want to go that way, but you don't even have to do that. You can invite total strangers from other groups that are in a similar type of uh, niches as your group that you've just created. Now, the thing is, as that group grows and as people interact and, and ask questions and such, you as the moderator have a lot of power to answer questions and you know be an authority in that group. And then people are going to be much more likely to take your recommendation to go to your website or your affiliate offer. Free traffic source number seven is TikTok. Now, TikTok is the new kid on the block, right? But it is growing wildly in popularity. TikTok essentially is entertainment-based storytelling in short videos. But the beauty of TikTok, it's super easy to get in front of a ton of eyeballs on TikTok. You know, on YouTube, it's a super great platform, but it's based more on searches, whereas TikTok is based on their algorithms where they'll show your video to a ton of people just to kind of see how people respond to it. And so, you know, once you start to get a good number of videos on there, TikTok keeps pushing those videos out to newer and newer people. Now with TikTok, you want to keep in mind that you're going to need to post between three and four videos every single day. Now, these can be very short videos, like seven seconds long or 20 seconds long. You know, it's not really hard to do, but you do need to do 
it consistently in order to drive the traffic that you need. All right, so I have given you seven really good free traffic sources. Now your job is to narrow that down to just two or three, or even start with one that you could start putting the time into that will work them and cultivate them into an excellent traffic source for you. Now, I guarantee that any one of these traffic sources will work for you, but it is not instant, right? <laughs> you know, you need to devote a few months to consistently putting content onto these platforms. You know, you need to work these various traffic sources before you can start to see a significant amount of traffic to flow from them because each one of these uh, social media platforms has algorithms and as you feed the algorithms with content, they like that. And it's funny to think about, but really within a few months that once you fed these algorithms, they start to reward you and put you in front of more eyeballs and you start to get a ton more traffic. Now, if you want to fast track your way to success, you know, if you want to shorten the amount of time that it takes to really see the traffic and see the sales and see the money flowing into your bank account, I want you to check out my number one recommendation for making money online. I'm going to put a link below this video in the description, and it's a training and mentorship program that has helped thousands of people, including myself, to fast track their way to success. So check it out. No pressure. It's totally up to you, and I'll see you in the next video. Take care.